very much for attending this event, uh, for understanding American Muslims. Uh, today, this uh, event has been organized by um, several people, and thanks should be uh, started for those people that uh, assisted uh, in the preparation and getting this event on the way. The, uh, American, the sponsors for this event are the Muslim community uh, of the Clinton Society, as well as the Quad Cities, the Sisters of St. Francis, uh, the Clinton uh, Ministerial Association, as well as, of course, Clinton uh, Community College for allowing us to have the space. Uh, we have a uh, group of speakers for you this morning uh, that will uh, shed some light about some of the issues that uh, you may have concerns about or have questions about. And then after that, we will have a question and answer session where you should uh, freely ask and uh, feel confident and comfortable that uh, those questions are shared with a lot of you as well as a lot of the Muslim, uh, uh, American Muslims that do exist in this community. Uh, I would like to bring to your attention that uh, the Clinton community is a very welcoming uh, group of people. Uh, you have a very robust and strong uh, presence of uh, Muslims in this community and they are in public service. Um, several of them are physicians as well as their families. Uh, they are here uh, to take care of you, to make sure that you and your families are well taken care of and they feel uh, your uh, issues, concerns as the world around us, unfortunately we're not anymore in just Clinton, Iowa, but we're in this small village that includes everybody in the world. So uh, we are exposed to those issues like you are exposed to them. We uh, feel the difficulties that you feel um, and also we also resent and denounce violence and um, abuse of humanity and religions. We feel as Muslims in this community that our religion is hijacked and our principles and beliefs are being um, questioned with not the American people but with uh, those hijackers that uh, took advantage of any religion specifically because they are not just targeting Muslims, they are basically targeting everybody. So the world is under attack and we need to, as a group of human beings that have principles and values and ethics, stand together, united against this um, violence towards belief because it's not just Muslims who are being attacked, God is being attacked. How that is, you have to look at it the way you believe, the way you see. And I feel that um, as a Muslim American and as a, a participant in this community, that uh, I, it is my role and everybody in the news says, well, why don't Muslims who are moderate or whatever talk about this or discuss it? Uh, well, in my belief, the religion is uh, your actions, your, uh, what you do every day is your belief. It's not when you go to church or you go to the mosque or you go to the synagogue. It is what you do. And my job is to take care of my people and my people is my community where I live. And that is my home. So I will defend my home in any way, shape, or form. And one of them is to help and participate in an event like this so that we can all come to an agreement and unite to help each other. With that, I thank you very much. And uh, we will start uh, this uh, uh, time by a recitation of the Quran. And we have um, Arabic and English um, recitation, the Arabic translation, uh, the Arabic uh, recitation will be read by Dr. Abdul Barry. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Lucky I'm not going to talk too much about her. She's, uh, she's a great speaker. Okay, I will read two small verses for Quran. 